Cool. So we have our first little little deal of the boom. We can go on here. Why did you and Daddy split up? I mean, I know that it was another woman, but was that all? If we look at our meters. Is that not enough? Well, I mean, an affair is normally a symptom, not a problem. I found your father's girlfriend to be a problem. <clears throat> we didn't communicate. Grew apart. So we're a little low still. But now that we've got common. it printed, we can kind of just pull this. Yada, yada, yada. Cool. Did Justin... No, 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 no. You are an accomplished, independent woman, and you don't need a man. I'm going to go ahead and throw a de -er on here. I like to put the de -er first. I love this uh, Waves. It's so easy, and usually the uh, the defaults are pretty pretty close to what I need. Uh, what the de -er does is any S's or sibilants is going to be reduced. So I'm going to. Why did them. you and Daddy split up? I mean, I know that it was another woman, but was that all? And it's not really even. Really well, I mean, an affair is bad. normally a symptom, not a problem. I found your father's girlfriend to be a problem. <clears throat> we didn't communicate. So I'm going to find the Grew threshold. Apart. Had nothing in common. I only want it initiating when the uh, has nothing happened. in common. Don't look at me like that. I just have one. I mean, it's hard to do. It's hard to ignore some of the noise that's still happening. But again, at this point, it's fine. And that's your dream in life. Just a cat to live happily ever after I, with. I am not wasting my time. Cool. So that's pretty good on the DSer. The lobs usually have a lot more sibilance. So the boom is kind of a light process. Why did you and daddy... Gonna throw a little EQ Why here. did you and Daddy split up? Gonna boost was that all? to find the frequency that I don't like. Not enough? A little low pass. Or well, I mean, an affair is normally a symptom, not a problem. I found your father's girlfriend to be a problem. <clears throat> we didn't communicate. Grew apart. Had nothing in common. Yada, yada, yada. Cool. Did Justin... No, 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 no. Cool. And this is a point of debate, really, but I like to go ahead and put a little compression on, on here. Why did just you to and kind Daddy split up? I mean, I know that it was another woman. Even but things out, and I can adjust this later if I need to. But I like to put a little bit. Why did of you light, and Daddy split up? Light compression. I mean, I know that it was another woman, but was that all? Is that not enough? Well, I mean, an affair is normally a symptom, not a problem. I found your father's girlfriend to be a problem. <clears throat> we didn't communicate. Grew apart. Had nothing in common. All right, so we've got that. Um, now we're going to go through and look at the lav channels. Why did you... So we know this is the boom for this. Boom. And lav. Why did you and Daddy split up? I mean, I know that it was another... So the same deal. We're going to do the same process. We're going to go through and... Um, going to gain these together, um, you... or not together, they're going to be gained separately, but they're going to all have the same noise level. Why did you and Daddy split up? I mean, I know that it was another woman, but was that all? Well, I mean, an affair is normally a symptom, not a problem. Cool. Okay, so we got all that. I'm just going to go through, and the ones that we don't need, I can even mute those. I'm going to hit send. All right, so now we can see all of our, all of the tracks that were not muted, or all the clips, are all going to be showing up in, um, and our our R X four, and I'm having a hard time saying that. R X four, and we can see the ones that were muted are here. No, 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 no. Okay. Okay. So now I'm just gonna go through and kind of do the same thing as we did with the boom. I mean, I know that it was another woman, but. Was that all? Okay, so here's that pretty specific thing. So I'm gonna, I'm going to use denoise. Denoise, find a good spot. Decent, and then listen to it. Why did 
did you and Daddy split up? I mean, I know that it was another woman, but was that all? Is that not enough? Well, I mean, an affair is normally a symptom, not a problem. Sounds good. No artifacts. Right on. Okay, so now we're going to go through and just listen for the clicks. And we really just need to listen to the dialogue. Why did you and Daddy split up? I mean, I know that it was another woman, but... So just a few there. Once you have these presets kind of set up. I mean, I split up. Why did you and Daddy split up? I mean, I know that it was another woman, but... Was that all? Is that not enough? Well, I mean, an affair is normally a symptom, not a problem. There's just a little one right there. I'm super picky about these, so a lot of these would be fine. Well, I mean, an affair is normally a symptom, not a problem. There's another one right here. Now, I'm not just selecting everything and doing it, because if it doesn't need it, it's always going to sound better if you don't, That's don't use it. Like there's a big That's one there. That's helpful. It might actually be more than what we can take care of in this plugin, but... That's helpful. Oh, yeah, so he's gone. You can really hear that. That's helpful. Hear that. That's helpful. And then afterwards. That's helpful. It's gone. Did, did Justin... No, 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 no. Grandma and Grandpa have it. Cool. All right, so that's done. Noise reduction is done. We're going to go back to the beginning and kind of do the same thing, the same process. Um, I'm going to go through and keyframe... Why did you... And keyframe around the audio, or around the dialogue. So I go there. Why did you and Daddy split up? They split up. Well, I mean, an affair is not Okay, this is her love. Um, our main actress is love. So I know that the other lines from the other lady. Is that not enough? We don't need in this track. So I'm going to kill that. Was that all? Well, I mean, an affair is normally a symptom, not a problem. And you can already tell this is why getting good lobs um, is so important. I'm not a problem. A lot of times in noisy environments, this is going to be That's where the money's at. That's helpful. So, like for this whole scene, if possible. That's helpful. Did Justin? I might just use the lobs. Right on. Okay, so now I'm going to go through. I got all that keyframed. I'm going to actually use my EQ again and knock out that super low frequency uh, energy and process that. In doing that, I also printed all those um, keyframes into the actual file now. So everything's And that's your dream in life, just a cat to live happily ever after with. Cool. So that's good. Now I'm going to go into my leveler again and... It should have the same settings as I had before. I'm going to actually make the speed a little bit slower on this one. Let's see. And then set clip gain. So you can kind of see what it's doing here. Um, it's recognizing this sound, saying, oh, this needs to be turned way up. I know that that's just noise. So I'm going to select that and delete it. Shift delete. And kind of just let that fade in a little bit more. Why did you and Daddy split up? Again, I'm just using this as kind of a guide. A woman, but was that all? And then using my ears. I mean, I know that it was another woman, but was that all? So obviously that sounds a little unnatural, so I'm going to delete that. Was that all? Find a good happy medium. Well, I mean, an affair is normally a symptom, not a problem. A symptom, that. not a Boost at the end. Okay, I'm pretty happy with this file. I'm going to go ahead and send it back. It's going to open up Pro Tools again here. And I still have that selected. So I'm good on the regions. And I know that it's going to be printed in that exact same spot. So I'm again going to use my P and my semicolon keys to move up and down. I'm going to move up to the LAV channel and hit Render. Now I can go through and um, listen to the mom's dialogue and do the exact same thing with this love. Cat to 
to live happily ever after. I, I am not wasting my time. Okay, so there's I, a little overlap I not, there. I, I am not wasting. I am not. Trying to kind of erase that little stutter. I am not wasting my time chasing something that doesn't exist. I am not doesn't exist. Remember to make that selection of the of everything I'm going to process, and do not move that selection because you'll need it when you come back to Pro Tools. Um, going to select that and hit Send. All right, I'm going to start moving a little faster here, and we're just looking for a good noise profile. So that's a pretty good profile right there, except for if you look, there's just a little thing here. A little bump. Nice thing is um, when I'm working with uh, noise profiles, I can actually, if I want to use this, uh, let's say we use like the pattern algorithm on the spectral repair, I can come in and select that specific bump. And what this is going to do is it's going to take a pattern measurement of the surrounding regions and it's going to fill this in with that with that pattern. Or at least that's what it's supposed to do. Let's see if it works. So yeah, it looks like it went, did pretty good. So now we have a pretty solid, uh, clean profile. So anytime that you have, like, say there's something that's just like a, it's a good blank, uh, there is a good no noise profile there, except for there's maybe some clicks or some pops. You can actually use um, the spectral repair to uh, make it clean and then take a measurement of it. And that'll, that'll make sure that you don't have any rogue um, frequencies in your noise profile. Okay, this is a really short profile. A cool little trick that you can try is if you hit, um, it, you can actually copy this, um, what's happening here by uh, control C. And then on PC, if you select another region and then hit alt shift V I think it's uh, gonna be the equivalent on the Mac as well but if you go and you select a region alt shift V it's gonna paste a special what it's gonna do is gonna paste it in that spot and not nudge the audio one way or the other if you were just to paste it it would move it like this so it made it bigger so we don't want that we want it to paste in place and cover that little gap. So now it might be a little rhythmic still, but now we have a pretty good uh, spot. So we're gonna look at the dialogue one on this. Since it's, if it's really specific, like you have specific rhythmic things happening, you wanna get a more general profile, then you can use this dialogue. They're happy. Okay, it exists, but it's extremely rare. And my mother made her whole life about my father. Is that what you want to do? Cool. Cool. Okay, I like that. That's good. Um, so now I'm just going to go through and do the keyframe thing again. Had nothing in common. Had nothing in common. Because a lot of times the noise that you hear in RX, since you're not watching the video, um, they'll actually be noise that coincides with that in the video so it, it makes sense Art. you can uh, analyze the the noise all you want to in rx but until you see it with the picture um you won't, don't want to get too surgical with it I had nothing in common yada 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 right on okay so we got all the keyframes in there we're going to zoom out so here's all our stuff we're going to take that eq and this is kind of dual purpose we're rendering this uh high pass filter but also we're printing our keyframes now we're going to listen for pops clicks uh, is that not enough is that not enough so there's definitely, definitely some on the end there so i'm going to go to declick decrackle 2.4 amplitude and these settings are just, I mean, there's other settings that'll work, but these are the ones that work for me. Is that not enough? Awesome.
Awesome. Okay, so that's done. D crackle's gone. Done with the EQ. Let's bring out our leveler. Okay, um, that looks good. I'm going to send back. I still have the same selection here on Pro Tools. Just hit render. Awesome. Okay, so now we've got that. Um, I'm going to just option click this de the the EQ, and the compressor. Um, just for now, we'll, we'll make the specific changes in a minute, and then we'll just listen to how this is sounding. I mean, I know that it was another woman, but was that all? Is that not enough? Well, I mean, an affair is normally a symptom, not a problem. I found your father's girlfriend to be a problem. So see, all that noise is actually she's putting on a jacket. Is that not enough? Well, I mean, an affair is normally a symptom, not a problem. I found your father's girlfriend to be a problem. So we'll do individual like processing on these noise noise problems that we have, like with the jacket and stuff. Um, but right now we're just doing the general overall. I found your father's it. girlfriend to be a problem. <clears throat> we didn't communicate. We were apart. Had nothing in common. Yada yada yada. That's helpful. And even that jacket just... will be a foley thing that's going to be happening at the same time, so it'll be <clears throat> nice and natural. And that's your dream in life, just a cat to live happily ever after with. I am not wasting my time chasing something that doesn't exist. Yes, yeah, a cat to live happily ever after with. I am not wasting my time chasing something that doesn't exist. Yes, yeah, see, but it does exist. I've seen it. It's rare, but I've seen it. And look, you've seen it too. Grandma and Grandpa have it, they're happy. Okay, it exists, but it's extremely rare. And my mother made her whole life about my father. Is that what you want to do? Cool, so I actually uh, had that, um, the ambience, the mono ambience roll in there, and uh, it seems like we're sounding pretty good. Um, there's a few things that are gonna take more attention later on, but um, if you can imagine, this process has to be done for the whole feature film, so these are gonna be the goal here is to get the dialogue all hitting in the right area as far as how loud it is. Um, a light touch up on the, the noise. I have still have isolated tracks from the boom uh, and each character's lobs are all on their own. I've got a, a light amount of EQ compression um, going on here and then just even a little bit of ambience here on an isolated track as well. Um, but the cool thing too is I still have all my original files to where I haven't nudged these. I haven't printed anything upon upon these. Uh, I haven't printed anything upon these tracks and um, have preserved my my workflow so that if I messed this up here, I can just come here, just drag this up and replace it with the original and redo that part. This is going to create a really nice smooth workflow um, that can happen between editors, um, something that will be kind of a, a an isolated process um, so that we can uh, move, move faster between different sound mixers or even um, as a practice to know where you're going to get started at. That is all I'm going to do for this video, and uh, stay tuned for some more cool, 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 feature film mixing. Bye-bye now.